Good afternoon, I'm Keenan Smith. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Health and business leaders are encouraging the public to get vaccinated against COVID-19 to ease the strain on hospitals. The Michigan Health and Hospital Association is teaming up with the Small Business Association and Henry Ford Health System. They say hospitals are filling up again, but that vaccines are the most effective tools to end the pandemic. Leaders are also concerned that Labor Day travel and students returning to school could mean a spike in COVID cases when many hospitals are already stretched to their limits. And Detroit school superintendent says vaccines and weekly testing are keeping the virus from spreading in their schools. Detroit uh, superintendent Dr. Nikolai Vitti appeared on CNN this morning. He says he believes the nation may need to talk about mandating the vaccine for employees and students in the future. Dr. Vitti says 72% of district staff members are vaccinated against COVID-19. And a firefighter in Macomb Township is inspiring a lot of people today by beginning a four day journey for a good cause. Joe Warren is raising awareness for fellow first responders battling cancer. He put on his full fire gear this morning for a mammoth walk across the state. Joe Warren will walk 140 miles for a third straight year. He took off this morning from Macomb Township and he's headed towards the Grand Rapids area. Well-wishers joined Joe as he began his journey, creating a parade this morning. You can find a link to donate to his calls on our website, WXYZ.com. Cool and breezy today across Metro Detroit and a passing shower can't be ruled out this afternoon either. High of 72, mid-70s for Friday and a warmer weekend with highs back into the 80s.